Are you a YouTuber? Are you looking to create your own channel? Are you looking to start up a new YouTube channel? If the answer is yes, then this video is for you. I'm not going to bore you with the same details of other videos that you've watched on YouTube where they tell you you need consistency, you need to select your niche, you need to be proactive, you need to make videos that are clear. Here in this video, I'm going to walk you through step by step on how you can create your own channel, how you can actually start from zero to get to 1000. I actually did it in less than two months. You can check my YouTube channel and confirm this. Welcome back. So in this video, we're going to start from the beginning. If you're looking to start up your own YouTube channel, the first thing you need to have is a Google account, a Gmail account. So I'm going to start from the beginning. I'm going to show you how to create a Gmail account. I know a lot of us already have Gmail accounts. A lot of us know how to create Gmail accounts. So because of that, I'm going to speed things up a little bit. Okay. Once you have created a Gmail account, you'll find a page that looks like this. Go straight to youtube.com. Click on the button on your top right and you get options like this and you click on create a channel. Once that is done, it brings you here. The first thing it's asking you is to give a name to your channel. Okay. So let's give this a name. We're going to title it healing where you are now after the title the next thing we're going to do is to upload a picture this picture is going to be the picture for the YouTube channel so you locate where you've saved your picture it could be a picture it could be a logo all right you size it up click done and the picture appears once you're done with that you click create channel a few seconds later the channel is created notice you don't have anything on this channel as it's been created except for the logo for those of you who have pictures that have backgrounds i'm going to give you a little tip on how to remove the background of an image so you go to pixcut.wondershare.com upload that's where you can actually remove backgrounds for free don't worry i'm going to leave the links in the description now when you get here you click on upload image you select the image that you want once you load the image in it will appear and then the background will be removed automatically for you on your right hand you download it for free now you save the image without the background and it's going to be saved as a png file which is exactly what you need because it's going to be sharper and clearer now i also suggest you go ahead to do same for all other images that you want to remove their background so you just do everything one time so once that is done, you come back to your YouTube channel, scroll down on your left hand side and you see settings, click on settings. It brings you to the settings page. All the settings here, just leave them as default. Now we'll go back to account, click on channel status and features. Now this brings you to your YouTube studio. This is where the whole magic is done. In your YouTube studio, it's going to take you straight to settings. So, you click the first one is general. You select the currency you want US dollar for United States. There's a whole lot of currencies. So, you select the preferred currency and then we'll move on to the next one, which is the channel. Now, you select country of residence. In my case, I'm going to select Nigeria. After which, you will now look for the keywords. Keyword is important because this is actually what is going to rank your channel among other channels. Now, let me give you a secret, a tip. The way to rank your channel is to actually go back to YouTube and search for other channels in the same niche as you. In this case, I'm going to search for Gospel Teachings. Now, 
and you can see it pops up channels that have very high views so I'm gonna select one of them and then I'm gonna look at the keywords that this channel has used to rank up after I've gotten the keywords that the channel have used to rank up I now start inserting same keywords in my own channel I start inserting same keywords in my own channel inspiration motivation motivational church speak speaker everything that has to do with your channel comes in after that that's the basic info after that you click on advanced setting under the advanced setting you select the second option you scroll down where you have the Google ad account linking you click on that now you have to link your account to a Google ads account if you have not set up that you need to set up that and put that there once you're done with that you head up to the next option which is the features eligibility the first one is the default features the upload videos is that collaborations is enabled so we need to enable the second option now what you to enable the second option is to verify your phone number so we'll go ahead and verify phone number fantastic now that we're done with that once you click on save it takes you straight to your dashboard now notice that no videos have been uploaded so you won't have any channel analytics okay in this dashboard this is where you're going to upload your videos everything that is required of the channel that's where your monetization is for instance now i've got zero subscribers zero watch hour i'm overhead back to dashboard now this is my dashboard everything is plain because i've not uploaded any video and i've not done anything to it okay now you click on the logo and then let's move to the channel click on your channel once youtube brings you here the next step you're going to take is to customize your channel all right you don't have any videos no playlist no channels no discussion and definitely the about is empty so we're going to fill all this in in order to improve the seo of the channel we're going to do all this so we click on customize channel once it brings us to channel customization we start with branding you notice that the logo is showing there so the next thing to do is to upload the banner if you need to change the logo that's where you do so the next thing we'll do is upload the banner but before then let's go to basic information we head up to basic information this is where we add the description and everything that would be displayed in about for the channel all right you're gonna make a little write up about your channel be very precise straight to the point and don't beat around the bush i've got mine written down somewhere my notepad so i'm gonna copy and paste once i do that i look for corrections if there are any corrections i make the corrections immediately the next thing i'm gonna do i'm gonna add some links to my channel all right if you're wondering what the links are i'm going to show you an example of the link i'm going to do a link on facebook all right let me show you an example of what the links are this is my channel uh, if you notice at the corner the side corner there you will see where it's written subscribe and also twitter handle to take you to my twitter account so that's the same thing i'm going to do i'm going to add facebook i've got the facebook written somewhere i copy that paste it there the email address as well is important so i'm going to write out the email address immediately i'm going to copy the rest of this and add it to the description after i'm done if everything looks okay you click on publish we'll go back to branding the logo is set so the next step is for us to create the banner let's view the channel just click on about you notice everything that we've written down everything has been set up the links the email address and also the description if you click on that it takes us straight to our facebook page now let's move on to creating the banner now we're going to use canva now i'm not going to go in details on how to use canva to design anything i already have a video showing how you can design thumbnails using the banner so you can check it out i'll put a link in the description below
once you've gotten the right banner you click on done next we're going to insert video watermark this appears on every video Inside that, you select entire video and you click publish. So go back to dashboard and then we'll click on logo there and go to your channel. We've been able to create the banner and we have the Facebook link inserted. So what I'm going to do next now is I'm going to make a little bit adjustment to the banner and make it a bit more appealing. So watch this. If you want to know how I'm doing all this, simply watch the video I've done on how to use Canva. I'm going to leave a link in the description below. It looks a little bit big so I go back and do some little bit adjustments again make it smaller take it up take it down I save it again and then upload again to the banner and then click publish so let's check it out again looks a lot better so I think this is better and this is what I what I need now in my next video I'm going to now show you how to set the SEOs for each of the videos as you upload them so that you know exactly how to do SEOs for videos. In my next video I'm going to take you through how to set SEOs for the videos how to upload the videos and get them ranked high and then you can achieve your 4,000 hours see you in the next video thanks for watching